Hello guys, day two in Singapore and today I'm going to Little India Haji Market um, and probably TBD other things um, but super excited um, this is the fit for the day um, so Little India is supposed to be like it's supposed to have like really nice streets like cute streets aesthetic I'm excited to take some pictures there and um, after that Haji Market Okay, I arrived to the Little India MRT station It's kind of, I don't really know where to go but I guess I'm just going to walk around and see Hello? Hello? And the buildings are like super colorful and really cute. <laughs> Made a stop to drink some tea, masala tea, it's a must. So that tea was really delicious and uh, now I'm headed towards exploring more. Um, I don't know, I was kind of looking at some place where they could do my eyebrows. But I don't know if I should just like get a thread and do it myself because I'm cheap ass. Um, also, not, that's not the main reason though. The people who are in this alone are usually men and I'm not comfortable. I think I finally found a salon that is like dedicated to female. So most of the other salon that I own is more like a barber shop and they also offered like an eyebrow threading which I was like a bit skeptical about. But let's go inside and do some eyebrow threading guys. So going to the temple, but I think first I need to make like a food stop. Yeah, let's see. Because I'm hungry, I have not eaten anything. This is like a really nice, colorful building. I think it's a temple, but very, very nice. And there's like a huge eating area here. Uh, so maybe I'll try something here. Lala, just like doing twirl and stuff. <laughs> this one guy came up to me and I was like, that's beautiful. <laughs> um, but I just came to this vegan place and everything is supposed to be vegan soy. So I ordered mock chicken noodle. Let's see how it is. What's this taste? It's pretty good for the mock chicken noodle. Um, I also asked for a little more chutney because Arizona told them no spice. This chutney is super spicy. I'm really, really like. Tasting like that. Super spicy. So I'm glad I ordered a non-spicy uh, food. These flower markets are absolutely incredible. Very, very pretty. I feel like I want to buy everything, but then I'm leaving tomorrow. So they have like vending machine where I can purchase Rosny Khan's movie. <laughs> CDs, I believe. Very fun. I came to the spot to get some sugar cane juice. It's very hot and I need to hydrate myself. So I did get a did get a sugar cane juice with ice. Hopefully this doesn't make me sick. Every time I have like outside water from which the ice is made, so I feel like I might get sick because it's a different country and with change of water your stomach kind of gets confused, you know. Apparently, there's a maid agency in Singapore. Interesting. It's like salary from $400 onwards. Okay, guys, I don't have enough charge, but I'm again in the, the I guess, Bay Area. Um, it's a really nice little music going on there, and I just kind of sit and listen. One to see the Oh, wait for. Right, 170. Oh. And right there is Clock Tower and the Victoria Memorial Hall. There is the Victoria Theatre. Don't really know much history, but that's the name that's written in the, in the building. Very cool. The lights will look more beautiful. Marina Bay Sands at the shop area 
all these shops are here and I'm just gonna kinda look around and see what's going on. There's a boat inside this uh, this shopping mall. Probably one of the fanciest mall. I think it's probably the, the fanciest mall I've ever been in. earlier that I didn't feel quite good about because they had, it had it had like bread in it and I couldn't eat it properly um, because it's melting in my hands but um. hello guys uh, so it is about like 11 p.m. and it's quite late although it feels safe just to be walking around people are still walking um, so I don't feel like unsafe or uncomfortable at all but I need to get home and pass out because I walked a lot today also ate a lot I think I ate a decent amount um, I ate a lot of fruits which I'm gonna do the same tomorrow but tomorrow I want to run and then afterwards treat myself with a great um, smoothie fruit smoothie that I can easily get from Chinatown um, so tomorrow that's the plan but for that I have to sleep early because I have to check out tomorrow at 12 um, so it's, it was a great day day to Singapore I think it is a very uh, walkable city so um, you know I, I, had the, I, I had the option to go by train or you know but I only took the train to Little India and back uh, because I didn't have GPS and it was showing one hour of walk which I was fine with but it was super hot in the morning uh, and also because um, I didn't really know if the road was quite safe you know that route at least like this route from my 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 hostel to the marina bay area uh, is very 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 walkable and nice like very walk friendly um and very you know kind of like elite streets so nothing to worry about um, but now i'm gonna go home and probably gonna brush my teeth and go to bed but thanks for tuning in